In recent years, supplement availability and use has rapidly spread to all aspects of Irish life. Supplements are now available in your local shops, in gyms and in pharmacies nationwide. Players should regard a supplement as any product used alongside food to enhance general health and well-being or sporting performance. The following generic types of supplements are just some examples of products that have been identified in the past as potentially containing prohibited substances. Testosterone boosters weight loss products, muscle building products, pre-workout and recovery drinks, vitamins and minerals. There are supplements on the market which explicitly say that they contain banned substances and declare that on the label. Others have no prohibited substances listed as ingredients, but do contain them. Some may have been accidentally or intentionally contaminated with prohibited substances or may be incorrectly labelled. As the supplements industry is not governed by the same regulatory requirements as the pharmaceutical industry, they do not have to be as stringent in listing every ingredient on the packaging. Some products may list ingredients under other names than those that appear on the prohibited list. For example, some supplements list geranium or geranium oil, but in fact this may be another name for methyl xenamine, which is a prohibited substance. Inadvertent contamination with a prohibited substance is common in supplement production. Deliberate contamination can also occur if a manufacturer wants to give the user a performance boost.